Have a look through your homework from last week. I made a decision. I'm going to hire all of you. Could I might as well do it now, McDonald's behalf. After all, that's how you're ending up with these test scores. You're not getting anything from this school. Nada. So you're all going to have to take your brownie points and your preschool scores into the arms of a chip-frying, chicken-grilling clown. But, saint that I am, God came down to me last night to give these degenerates one last chance. As Lord Duff told me, you have 10 minutes now to write me something better than you did last week. 10 minutes is all you're getting, and she give you just about enough time to poop in your diapers and hand that to me, because it's still gonna be better than that. Right, get to work. India. Yes? What exactly are you doing? I'm filming a gross misconduct of the school rules. Something you should be dealing with. India, I swear to... Look, the head obviously gave me permission, otherwise I wouldn't be doing this. See? It's my new show for the school. The head agreed, so you need to as well. Fine. That's what I thought. You know, people who get everything they want, India, usually lash out when... Well, someone finally disappoints them. What's your point? Well, you're dating that boy Edward, aren't you? Yes. Bit of an underperformer in class. I suppose that translates to home life as well. That's right, India. With these kind of shoes being allowed at our beloved school, this will only encourage students to commit more crimes in the future. They will get a taste for being defiant. Some of them break crimes for years without anyone knowing. India's dad would know. Yes, thank you, Edward. In an office, behind a desk, just moving, did you say? What the <coughs> hell, Edward? We're going to have to do another take now. Please, no. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, baby. I'm just bored. I don't get to say anything. And you sure shoes are that pressing right now? Let's talk about some of the gossip in school. Mickey told me that Molly's mum didn't send a thank you note to Lily's mum after she let Molly stay over. No, no. Although, there is some juicy gossip to tell me later, but we can't. We're not going to be like the other dumb students who get their entertainment from spreading rumours. Plus, I asked and had said no. You know, I think we've got enough here to edit all together. I mean, we have done about ten takes already. Yeah, but in four of them my hair was tied back so I looked homeless, and in five of them Edward made some dumb joke every time I finished a sentence. I was trying to add something. You did. It just wasn't humour. Yeah, uh, I've got to get back for my mate's high school plan on GTA, so uh, I'll edit what we have together and upload it after. Fine. I'll see you next week. This. It's going to break the internet. <laughs> Come on, baby, I'm sorry. Just stop asking me. I get it now, so we didn't break the internet. It's about the news, not the gossip. I know that now, okay? Yeah, but I expected to get some views. Like maybe it's YouTube. Maybe we only got 20 views because we got hacked or something. You know, like when YouTubers suddenly get no views and they start complaining. Or maybe no one gives a shit about your dumb new show. Um, we've booked this room, so you can leave and take your opinions with you. I just hear it was part of a detention. The, the head told me. The head told you? Why did you even start this thing? You aren't exactly liked here, you trying to piss more people off. Sorry, do, do I even know you? 
What, because you think you know everyone in school? I think we should get on along with it. We only have like an hour. So you can just sit there and watch quietly. <laughs> I won't be watching, you'll be on my phone, thanks. Yeah, of course you won't be watching. Now we're trying to stop people like you. Stop me doing what? Wearing shoes? Why don't you actually talk about something that matters to people or that they care about? <laughs> it's kind of boring. Exactly. If you're going to do this, at least make it vaguely interesting. Not just something to make mommy and daddy proud. Edward! Yes, 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 yes. Uh, what is happening here? Um, <laughs> when she gets, like, angry or distressed, she likes to brush my hair. It reminds her of when she used to brush her horses. Uh, your horse. Uh, yeah. And he's dead. Don't even go there. Thank you, Edward. An insightful look into the unworthiness of PE in the school curriculum. Are you kidding me? Cut. What? PE is a pointless subject that kids are forced to do, which encourages aggression in their behaviour. What do you possibly have to complain about now? I study sports science. Case in point. Let me have a go. What? <laughs> no. I can actually show you how to make people watch the show. It isn't even your show anyway, it's the school's. Uh, she can take TV presenter as part of her detention. Are you kidding me? I'm not letting her ruin this. Why don't we let her do it for a bit? It might help, baby. I'll let her do it, just so I can watch her screw it up. Ready? Wait, there's no script. What are you going to talk about? How detention leads to TV presenting. You can just follow my lead. Let's talk about sex. Come on, we all do it. But where is the best place on campus to have sex? No, 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 just no, I'm, I'm done with this. No, no. Then leave then. Doubt you have any experience in that department with Blue Balls Chat over here. Blue Balls Chat. Let's be real, you are not getting any follow through with Dry Vag Bitch over here. That, that's it. This is over. I have better things to be doing than being insulted and thrown aside for a, a trashy, trashy, mm -hmm. slut dog. Dog? Seriously? Yeah, you're a dog. Ruff, ruff, bitch. Fuck me. I knew you were a lesbian for me. Um, I'll have you know the only woman I'd go lesbian for is Hillary Clinton. So you'd have sex with Hillary Clinton? No. More like Hillary Clit on, am I right, India? You ready, Eddie? Yeah, okay. <laughs> um, what do you think's going on here? You're not presenting again. I mean, everybody hated your episode and loved our episode. And plus, the head told me when I came back today that I should present again. Such a lie! Where's your letter? Maybe we should let her present. We did get over 1,000 hits in that episode. We should do it, especially if the head said. Fine. But I'm presenting too, so you can watch Edward. Okay, baby. And there you have it. Just another example of how dyeing your hair can lead to child soldiers in the military. The only thing that was truly terrifying about that clip was your whiny voice. See? Another example of how a deviant teen would act. She's the type who would dye her hair just to seem more emo. The only emo thoughts I have is thinking about your sex life because she's so sad. Let's talk about boyfriends and when it's truly the right time to kiss. For example, not on school property. Actually, I agree with that. No one wants to see your gross adolescent lips just smacking each other for a solid five minutes. There you go. If Violet agrees with me, then I can't be wrong. But I think we should talk about something serious. Something that actually matters. Nope. Here we go. Cyberbullying. Look, hear me out. This isn't another one of those dumb assemblies where you get a leaflet at the end, which no one ever reads. Just don't fucking Rock do it. Cut. 
why'd you cut? I was actually getting somewhere. Yeah, back to the chocolate factory to turn into a blueberry. Oh, stop. That's embarrassing. We just don't talk about that kind of stuff here, okay? And really, your advice is just don't fucking do it. Yes, don't fucking do it. <clears throat> Some people just need to be told to stop doing it and not act like dumb twats. Yeah, but it doesn't work, okay? So let's just leave it to the teachers. Seriously, you rather not talk about gossip or things that actually matter, but <clears throat> hair dye is such a priority. It might not be to you, but it is to me, okay? Right, because that's what matters. Whatever. Good. That's what I was hoping for anyway. Come on, Edward, let's do this properly. No, India. I think she might be right. What? Look, this shit matters to me. I know what I'm talking about more than what teachers would think and stuff. The reason I'm here is because I did it, okay? I knew it! I knew of course you're a bully! India! Don't call me India! Okay, if you want to keep on being my Patrick Swayze, you call me baby and nothing else. You're insane! Of course you haven't seen Dirty Dancing. Oh, I actually have. I liked it. My mum liked it better. Oh, sorry. Uh, carry on, carry on. I think I'm going to go. Yeah, I don't want to be here tonight. No, you're staying. Oi, he can do whatever the hell he wants. Uh, shut up! Okay, we're only doing this to stop him from ending up like his dad. Wait, I'm, I'm sorry, Eddie. Don't call me Eddie. <sighs> Should I go? So you and Ned broke up? <clears throat> yes, well, <clears throat> I broke up with him after he said he wanted to break up with me. Oh, I see. You don't seem to be up about it, though. Well, I asked the head if I could brush his hair, but then he refused, so when I threatened to call my dad, we compromised. He said I can do this last show to make me feel better. Did he break up with you during the meeting? Yeah. It was so cruel. Just as the head was finished telling us off for uploading all those awful videos with Violet, Edward just spat that out at me. I guess that's why he's not here. Uh, but where's Violet? Well, let me tell you, now I know why she loves gossip so much, because she's always the one causing it. She wasn't even supposed to be here for the last two weeks. She's only supposed to be here for one for a detention. And she lied about the head letting her present. He didn't even watch that episode. Maybe she just came to make friends? Maybe not. Wait. Oh my god, he... He didn't watch the episode. He didn't watch any of them. Not Mr. Mars, you couldn't be filming. Not the head. Definitely not Violet. No one cares, do they? I thought you knew that already from all the low views and, you know, how, that's how you said about it's about the news, not the views. You made t-shirts. I know, but maybe it is. You, you made me wear this around campus the whole time. You didn't have to. But you said you'd get your dad to buy my house and make me homes if I didn't. Yeah, see, there was a choice there, but back to the point. If no one actually watches, who am I talking to? What's the point just ranting to the air? For the uni credit? Start recording. But you said... I know, just please record. Hello viewers. This will be our last broadcast here from Southfield News. You may have noticed some changes recently to our structure and presenting styles. Truth is, I didn't really care. 
I'm only doing this to get into university. I'm just doing this pointless show because I can. The head's only letting me do this because my parents called him up and when they do, I can do whatever I want. I get into the best schools. I will have access to the best jobs. I can manipulate my boyfriend into doing anything I want by feeding him a load of of bullshit. And my parents do that too. My dad's getting away with fraud by pinning it all on Ed's dad. Just like me, they're using our privilege to get whatever we want. People who can make a real change can't. You okay? Um, I'm gonna talk to the head about letting Violet and Ed do the last show. They might only be allowed to do the one, but maybe they can get people to actually watch. You might as well go home, there's no point uploading this. You were saying some good stuff though. About what? You know, about your parents and stuff. Yeah, so maybe no one sees it. But one person might, and it might help. Positive messages, better than no messages at all. About the news, not the views, remember? Okay. Let's do it. Rolling. Uh, roll two, scene two, shot two, take one. I was wondering if I saw it. Yeah, that's not the matter. It's not in the shot. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, one word. <laughs> one rubbish director. Anyway, okay, cut. Because I was going to keep us rolling. But. Okay.